Hello and welcome to Master Detectives Archive Rainco Plus. Oh, okay, so I apologize for the delay. Yes, now <laughs> I, there's two things that are there's a few things that's very ironic on on October 50. One is that now it's raining as we speak, and I thought it's going to turn storm. Hopefully, it doesn't. Please, please, really don't. And and second, yes, I also realized that today is also my my uh, happy affiliate anniversary. So sorry, I can't tell you what what how many years I've been doing affiliated. But let's just say it's age is not a the age is not a limit, but a number itself. So. At least I got it a bit of experience of so moving on now. So, yes. Yes. We're playing a new game of Paul. Of, of this game. Yes. I'm, and yes, I'm still taking a rest from the, the Yakuza series for a while. But I'll be playing by once I finish up this one. And, and let's see all this thing. So, okay. So, this is also the same developer from Danga Rampa or Spike Chunsa. But it's also my Tohyo again. So, okay. So. So yes, I mean actually looking forward to this game, but because it was on Switch, I didn't get to play it. And second of all, it, I was supposed to stream this game about like last month, or, but after finding out that this game has has only have Japanese wordings and no English this stuff, so I'm a little bit skeptic. Until they say, oh, they're going to patch up on. On October. On October. So yes, that's it. And I'm back with DVD in different console. Ah, uh -huh, okay. Hey, Amanda. Nice to meet you now. Welcome back. back. Oh, so yes. This week is also going to be stacked because Halloween is this this year this month is also Halloween month of October. So so yes, this is what we're gonna do. And DVD is also might be going to be coming up to once once the Halloween special of DVD is up comes out, I'll be also streaming that game as well now. So okay, anyways, anyways, for those who do not know who I am, my name is Anderson, I'm a Golden Fortune Cat VTuber from Malaysia, Yoshiko Nyao, and may purchase me with you. So if you'd like to have a want to have a little bit of luck in yourself and 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 being feel down with yourself and want to pray for good fortune, give a like, follow, subscribe to my Twitch channel and check out my YouTube channel from VODs and may purchase you. Yeah. All right, so yes, so again, this is a blind playthrough, so I have no idea what you're gonna expect. So, and instead of using my my con controller that I will use, so I'm gonna use a keyboard instead. So, to see how it goes. But I haven't. But do know this is my first time trying it, so I haven't tested out fully yet. So. So I haven't tried to test it out. Yep, we are Amanda, so Okay, so let's how about we just kick start it, shall we? Let's get started, shall we? In exactly the heck I'm... Huh? No. 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 <laughs> Ouch! Oh, oh, look! A human! It's been a while! <sighs> anyway, that was a good nap. I nearly slept through the whole thing. Let's see... Alright! There's something I have to do first. Okay! Human, listen up. First, I'll have you select your difficulty. Choose wisely. 
complain about it later, and I'll boom kill ya. Now then, display the options. Okay, lenient, mean, troublesome, adorable. What? Oh wait, I can move my mouse. Okay, so I, so if my, uh, let me know in the comments if, if the volume here is a bit loud or something. So let me know in stuff here. Uh, lenient, mean, adorable, troublesome. Uh, what? Uh, is adorable super easy or baby? Lenient, mean, troublesome. Okay, I'm guessing that lenient is normal. Uh, hard. Uh. Super hard, uh, adorable. <laughs> what? S baby mole? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna choose Linian. Linian! Oh, you sure about that? Don't say I didn't warn you. Hmm. You wanna know what difficulty that is? Uh, the one normal? you selected is how difficult yours truly will be on you. I'll be as difficult with you as you wish. So, I hope you're ready. Though, to be honest, it's all the same no matter what you pick. What? I'm your lenient, mean, troublesome, adorable partner, after all. So, Oi. are you hey, what option I do now? Do you want to start for real? Do you seriously want to start? Seriously? For real? Uh... You have seriously start for real, don't start. Okay, I'm going out. No, okay, okay, let's start for this for real now. Let's go. Huh, guess you're really here for it. Sounds like you're just dying to solve some mysteries. You just can't wait to go on adventures with me, right? <laughs> Humans are so weird! Well, let's get this started. It's time to embark on my lovely, thrilling, wonderful, mystery-solving adventure. Let's go! With my ghostly companion. <laughs> Chapter 0, Massacre on the Am Amaterasu Express Uh, what? <laughs> well, uh, first dead body on the week Okay. Never mind, he's not dead body. Whoa. What's going on? W wait. Huh? Where am I? Never mind, it's not a dead body. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ouch! Ow. By the way, nice set of shoes. Who? What? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> so, okay, so I only know by summary, but not fully, so I'm playing at this guy, so this boy, so. <gasps> uh. <gasps> Why? How? I can't remember anything. Does that mean... Do I have... What was it called? Amnesia? Uh, Alright, calm down. Take a deep breath. I can't remember anything! 
Where am I? Who am I? Why can't I remember? Inside your pocket. Huh? Yeah, it's Pilot. <laughs> Check your belongings. Check your belongings. Who's there? Am I hearing things too? I lost my memories and now I'm hearing things. What's going on? Ow! <laughs> <laughs> I think the Yogo says that. Okay, you only that way. Hey, lad. She's like, okay, you know what? Screw it. Oh, <laughs> oh, what now? I can't catch a break. Hmm. Check my belongings. Huh. An envelope. Notice. The World Detective Organization, Human Resource. The dear Yuma Coco Head, you are here by dispatch to uh, spec something autonomous zone of Hanai Ward. Dispatch duration indefinite. Use this use the enclosed ticket to board the Amaterasu Express to Kanai Ward. Runs of war with the master detectives on site. Upon arrival, proceed to the Nocturnal Detective Agency will World Detective Organization Kanai Wall Branch. There you will receive further instructions. World Detective Organization Human Resources. Dear Yuma Coco Head, you are hereby dispatched to the Special Autonomous Zone of Kanai Ward. Dispatch duration indefinite. Use the enclosed ticket to board the Amaterasu Express to Kanai Ward. Rendezvous with the master detectives on site. Upon arrival, proceed to the Nocturnal Detective Agency, World Detective Organization. Con there you will receive further instructions. Go forth, proud detectives. Eliminate all mysteries from this world. Okay, so that's what's the down part. Yuma Coco Head? That's my name? Thinking on it, I guess that sounds right. Are you sure it's another different name like Makoto or something? <laughs> yeah. That's right! I finally remember! My name is Yuma! I'm Yuma Coco Head! But what's this about a World Detective Organization? It sounds significant. Am I a part of it? Am I a detective? I guess so. <laughs> I guess these kind of look like a detective's clothes. <laughs> no, that looks like a school club to me now. <laughs> it seems I was supposed to get on a train. Or at least, I think so. Master Detectives? Am I... One of them? Could there be someone who knows me on the train? Here's the ticket. Let's check the schedule. Amaterasu Express Special Train. Hey, it's almost time. Well, I should get on that train. I'll find out more about myself if I meet. Attention! <laughs> Before rushing to the train, let's set the basic controls. Okay. Okay, WSE, okay. Ah, so good. At least I can know it's on keyboard, so. Oh, yeah, I will recommend oh, moving oh. camera around and this upon the surroundings. Oh. Place, place and examine the Makshika inspect. Make sure. Better write this down. Okay, password expect. Cinemix can be skipped. Uh, how? Gotta stay in that detective mindset. Detective points DP can be earned by conducting detective. Activities like investigating and getting. Sure, hope you got all that down. I think DP increase the detective points. Maybe rank some cool. Don't you forget. I got a minimum. Okay, so then. Okay, let's see if I can just move around. Okay, so I think it's fine for now. No dehydration. No sunning. Oh, zoom in on the map. Oh, okay, so it's just zoom in on the map. Okay, let's see what's this one. 
shove under the. Oh, here we go. why are there so many umbrellas? The label reads "Lost Items Temporary Storage." Yeah, you might want to know why the heck are you here in the first place, but okay, what's this one here? Back up to the room. Hmm. Okay, there's some parts that doesn't voice, so uh, I'm trying to give. Okay, maybe I just give a normal voice for now. So, oh, there's something at the back. I can't get through with all this thing in the way. Stars might fall on if I try to move it. I better not go back there. Okay, so I can't go that side. So now, uh, this one here. Bags, hats, and books. A lot of stuff has been placed here. Okay. Hey, what's this? A toy robot? It looks sturdy. The label says lost items. I guess the kid just lost this thing for now. Okay, so anything? Oh, maybe he card box. This is. There's a card box here. I can peek inside through the hole. But this is too dumb to make anything out. Uh, I don't suppose you can pick it up and just. You know what? No. Okay. Okay. Go outside. I get it. The place where I was sleeping was in fact. Station lost and found. Pawn shop. Gym storage. <laughs> okay. Station lost and found. That's right. I've been sleeping in a station's lost and found section. But why was I sleeping here? Bring two, screw! <laughs> okay. Did I faint? Or was I attacked? If so, then who did it? Attention passengers departing this station direct to Kanai Ward on the Amaterasu Express. Please board immediately. The train will depart soon. Uh, I have to get on that train. I better hurry. Uh, one second. Alright, back again now. Anyways. Okay, time to go. Interesting, this thing has some has some good graphics. So okay, to elaborate on what on why I like this thing. Can I want? I'm sorry. The Amaterasu Express will now depart. Whoa! <laughs> There's no lag in the thing, so this is good. <laughs> yeah, majority of the time when I play Yakuza series, it's like lagging a bit on, on stuff, but this one is. I'm impressed oh, on the animation. Need it in time. Oh, so yeah. Thank you for choosing the Amaterasu Express Direct to Kanai Ward. Our train utilizes Amaterasu Corporation's state-of-the-art technology for an automated, safe, and comfortable. There is no automatic. Oops, I. So nobody's driving this thing. Oh, oops, I. I am skipped that thing. Uh. This train has five cars. It will operate non-stop to its destination. Food and beverages are available in car 2. Restrooms are available in car 1 and car 5. In case of an emergency, visit the backup control room in car 3 and contact control headquarters via the intercom. We hope you enjoy your trip aboard the Amaterasu Express on your journey to Kanai Ward. So there are five cars. 
This must be car one at the front. I'd better find the other detectives and meet up with them. If we use this... The number manu- the ma number manu features info investigation. Yo, you know. check, check! <laughs> you spot- Is that a new case? Near million killings, oh boy. Chapter- Case files and you see- Whoa, this stuff's vital! It saves the company confessor at the start. How can we need this model? You definitely want to remember this. You can save- Hey! Okay, so I can actually save- this. I could save scum it, but <laughs> let's see how it goes in my and that's a wrap. Enough shit silly can be adjusted. Okay, so I think I Okay, uh let's try first before we do anything. Uh can I Oh I can't it's not escape but just save. Okay, it's just save a bit first. Just in case I screwed up now. Okay, so oh hi goes mouse. Case files, okay. If you're that lost, why not check your notes? In case file, you see outline in case of summary. Massacre, you are awoke in the in the strange station of animation. But search and the work to blah 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 blah. Okay. Okay, so it's just profile. Use whatever you gotta to get the job done. Burn it into your brain. Personal information you can see. Okay, here's one is blood type zero, but they question mark. Height 150 cm, weight 45 kg, likes detecting nose, dislike amnesia. <laughs> you already have any amnesia? Pilot, muscle detective, question mark, talent, uh. This mob is unsuitable for physical. <laughs> I'm not spoiling for this for. Yep, try not to. So. Because this is this is why so I put a. Simple. Put the gloss I tree. see. Yeah, this is why I put the, the term of blind playthrough. So I have no idea how this is going off. So. No spoilers, thank you very much now. Okay, so let's look around first. Main control A. It says main control room A. The door's locked. It won't open. There's a driver's seat inside, but no one's there. The machine appears to be functioning. That must be the automatic operation to It won't open. I guess that's obvious. And this is the front car. The nose of the train is just beyond it. Yeah, I get so, cause based on the structure of the train there, if you open a, the the door there, by, I, let's say it's the door's broken and you open the door, the, you might be fling out of the, the train. If it opens, I could fall off. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's probably... Why is this? Okay. It's a map of the train. Okay. The first and last cars can control the train. The rest are passenger cars. Okay, let's see. First one restroom is here. Infirmary is the first car. Then the second car is the dining car. Third one is the rooms and backup control room. Fourth is the rooms and... The fifth one is nearly the same. I guess it's just in case that people have having issues to go there, so... Yeah, I'm guessing that if the pe people are stuck in the third car, they either go to the fifth car and go to the first car. Then again, if somebody is already stuck in the fifth car, <laughs> like say they're stuck in the toilet, or somebody using it, they have to rush to the first car. Then again, it's only like, one, two, three, four. There's only like five rooms, so I doubt that's possible now. Okay, anyways. Well, it says I need to get a lot of, of stuff, so, uh, who you're Wait, who's this? Uh, no, my me now is. There's a warning on the door. Okay, oh great, I'm not. Please keep your hands clear of the doors. For your safety, doors will remain locked while the train is in motion. Okay. One. I don't think I can run at the moment. But... Hey. There's a sink and toilet inside. This must be the restroom. There's no one inside it right now. Can I check it? No dead boy. <laughs> Mirror! Hmm. Ah, some parts are not voice, so I can see my reflection in the perfectly polished mirror. I'm still not used to it. Is it really my face? Hmm. The restroom window looks fixed and put in place, so it can't be open. 
I don't see any of the detectors through the window. Time is... Time to move on. Uh... Maybe someone's inside the toilet, I guess? Excuse me? Hello? Anyone there? Here? I guess there's no one here. Yeah, I'm trying to get the detective point just for like, point and clicking here, so... But, I doubt we can run. Okay, what- Oh, okay. I see a clean looking bed. This is probably the infirmary. It's locked, but there's no one inside. Okay, can I open the door at least? Huh? The infirmary seems locked. Oh. Wait, what, what, what? 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 Huh? The infirmary seems locked. I can't see- I can see inside through the window, but no one's there. I wonder why it's locked. Why are the people supposed to do if they get sick? Yeah, I suppose that's logic. What's this one? Main control B. It says main control room B. The door is locked and won't open. I see a driver's seat in there, but no one's inside. There's a machine, but... Driver's seat's on both sides of the train. I think that means they can go in either direction. Ah, just like the... Ah, just like the monorail. Yeah, you see that... If you notice the, that most monorails had had a passenger seat in both both ends, right? And the, sorry, the driver's seat in both ends. So at least they drive here and there, so they can control here and there. So I'm guessing that control room B is to move to the right side forward, while A is the the opposite side. So yeah. Oh, I kind of sounded like a real detective there. No, it's just common sense. So yeah, but then again, yeah. It's a map of the train. Yeah, this is the stu- Yeah, this- Yeah, I think I've seen this one. Okay, time to go in here. Huh? Someone's there. I heard a voice behind the- Hello? One, two, three- Oh, we got five! Uh. Okay, let's see. Whoa! And it's no. Hey, who's this cute guy? Excuse me, are you with the World Detective Organization? You are, right? You're master detectives, aren't you? Uh, uh why is the we are? But who are you? Wait, is the ear his e is his ears twitching? Wait, what? The <laughs> Wait, is that a cat? <laughs> a blue cat? <laughs> oh, okay. Now I noticed that it's just a cat, like my mind. Um, I'm with you. I think I'm also a master detective of the world. De a boy like you? Master detective of the WDO? It seems like it. Seems like it. Like hell, dumbass! Whoa! Who the hell? <laughs> huh? A runt like you, a master detective? You're just shooting your mouth off. You look like a shriveled anteater. Well, says to the guy who's wearing a mask that looks like a yakuza hug. Anteater? What's the meaning of this? You got a lot of nerve posing as a master detective. You wanna die right here, right now? W wait, please hear me out. Oh, right! Uh, I have proof that I'm a master detective! A letter? From the World Detective Organization? It's real. There's no mistake about it. What? Are you serious? Looks like there's a reason behind this. Go ahead and tell us. Right, thank you. But there's really not much to explain. Oh, uh, blah 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 blah. <laughs> what this first one was like? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. <laughs> wow, <laughs> I love the fact that he, he just do a cutscene like blah 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 blah. So yeah, 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 blah blah blah. Okay. 
And that's how it happened. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that is a little a bit more more better than a lot of people try to explain long story, cutscene and like that. But this was like like fast forward and I get some explanation. That's it. <laughs> Amnesia. Looks that way. I was hoping one of you would know who I am. Apparently not. No way. We're on the same team, but no one knows me? Then who am I? Okay, you're gonna That's have to That's what I wanna know. Besides, even if the letter is real, you may not be the right recipient. Why do you suspect me? There is a reason why. But first, do you know what the World Detective Organization is all about? Um, a little bit? I think I remember a little. Or not. Guess not. So you called yourself a member without even knowing. Oh, come on! Uh, don't, give, don't give him a hard time. I mean, he just got in mid the act, so it's, it takes time. And plus, the train just came. Um, was about to take off, so come on, give him a little break here, Mr. Mr. Cat Boy. Uh, not me, I mean the black cat boy over there. Yes, sorry. Well, I suppose it's a master detective's duty to shepherd the lost. Very well, I'll tell you. Maybe you'll regain your memories after hearing what I have to say. Wait, hold on. Why this guy almost look like my like my brother? You know what? I'm not going to count that thing, but uh, thank you. Okay, so okay, so I think I have to talk to everybody except I think I will have to talk to him last. But let's try to talk to everybody. Uh, wait, wait. Can I go back here and see anything? Nah, that's, that's not no point in interest, so... Okay, uh... What? What do you want? <laughs> uh... Nothing? What? Uh, everybody's on edge right now! What is it? Uh, nothing? Uh, what's that thing on the table? Uh, can I see that thing? No. Oh, j Hey, she's cute! <laughs> Still, I love the design of <laughs> it. They make up well, everyone with this outfit, so you know I think these two more like can be be partners in crime and this and things. So okay, okay. Anyways, okay. Uh, Listen up. The World Detective Organization is an extra legal, extra privileged organization devoted to eradicating the world's unsolved mysteries. Their branches exist throughout the world, and their investigations are handled by master detectives. As of now, there are roughly 1,000 master detectives in the WDO. All have powers specializing in investigative work. Powers? They are supernatural powers used in investigation, known as forensic fortes. People who develop talents such as clairvoyance or mind reading. They train at the organization to harness these special powers, which aid in their investigations. Those who manage to gain a forte are recognized as master detectives and given a detective deed. Which means, if you're a master detective, it should say so on your license. Detective deed? It's an identification card. Check your pockets. I don't have one. If you don't have a detective deed, you ain't one of us. Even if you got one. I'd suspect it's fake anyway. Will you give him? Will you back off on him, Mr. Yak? Will you, Mr. Uh, you know what? Moving on. Mr. Tuck, like. Oh, hold on! I'm not trying to trick anyone! Um, pardon me. He seems to be the only one accused of being an imposter. 
But how about the rest of you? Thank you! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> if you require he has some sort of proof, then the same would apply to everyone here. Huh? The hell did you just say? She's right. Everyone here has just met for the first time. Naturally, we would doubt one another. Huh? First time? So, you guys don't know each other? Master detectives rarely meet together. We each travel the world on our own, solving cases. I've never seen so many gathered together for a case like this. We thought all of the summoned members had shown up and were about to start introductions. Then you walked in. I see. Well, let's start the introductions. We'll include the tardy one as well. Tardy? You still want to do introductions? With the imposter too? It's vital for us to ascertain each of our identities moving forward. All the more reason due to this uh, perplexing circumstance. Perplexing circumstance? What does he mean by that? Now, let's begin. Okay, so I talked to everybody. Uh, you know what? I talked to the girl also, just to be courteous. So, okay, let's talk to the old guy. I am. This guy looks like so <laughs> like someone from Metal Gear Solid. So, I am Zange Eraser. I come from a detective agency on the front lines, far from here. Uh, yes, don't mind my swamp thing. Ah, yeah. This is a... Oh, I... Uh, wait. Zungi Eraser! Hi. Snake. <laughs> Perhaps you expect an introduction. But I have nothing to say. Yeah, I remember silent type thing, so he might Let the past melt like ice in an evening stream. That's how I live my life. Your name is not happen to be Raiden, isn't it? No, it's not. That's a different game. And who the hell is Raiden anyway? The Mortal Kombat character? Uh, <laughs> my forte is thoughtography. I can transcribe images from my memory onto electronics. Tography. I can transcribe images from my memory onto electronics. You mean like the one in your uh your 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 eye your eye patch? That's all for me. There's no need for any further explanations. There's clearly something extraordinary about him. Yeah, I rather not try to go near him. provoke him otherwise you might get killed. Can I talk to him some more? Uh, I got nothing to say. It doesn't seem like he'll say anything else. Okay. Uh, you know what? I better talk to this guy, these three. Because this guy looks getting chill, so maybe. Okay. Uh, thanks for backing me up, so. I'll go first. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Zilch Alexander. Zilch Alexander. Zero Alexander. <laughs> yeah, result means zero or oh, not out of it. But... Zilt Alexander. I'm from the Southern Forest Preserve District's detective agency. They call me Nature's Mediator. Ah, <laughs> you know, the for the moment there, I thought he's like, like the type of. Based on his cat ears, I thought he would be some sort of like, you know, can control animals here and there. But when you say nature mediator, like, uh, he is like controlling plants, isn't it? Or like, let's say his forte is to, to listen to the plants, I think? I love people, nature, and the harmony between them. However, there are times when some would attempt to ruin that harmony. My specialty is in handling those people. Uh, by you, by becoming poison ivy, <laughs> hey, or those kind of nature people, like the, you know what I'm. Have you heard of the chain of mysterious murders surrounding the dam construction at Souls Lake? Rumor has it that one by one, 
everyone involved with the dam's construction died, all cursed by a sunken ritual site. It was a once in a century difficult case. The one who solved it was none other than myself. There wasn't much to it. The culprits were locals who wanted the rights to the dam for themselves. Everyone got out of the way, and everyone wants it for you, cat boy Zilt. <laughs> Sorry, I, I didn't say that thing out loud. <laughs> the strange part is that all 52 villagers were in on it. They all kept their lips sewn shut to protect the secret. I'll uh, let so you they figure do... out what so... that means. Um, uh, you let them live and just let the thing slide and just say it's solved, but just put it as. Something else, I think? When yeah. harmony between man and nature is disrupted, disaster strikes. That is one thing I have learned as a detective. Nature's mediator? He does look like a good detective. Though he suspected me, he still gave me a fair chance to explain myself. Yeah. Yeah, because, I mean, this guy is almost like me. <laughs> this guy is almost like me, but... But... But as a black color character, and uh, and he's, uh, you know the, and based on my outfit, I was like, it's a, he's wearing something differently. I'm not wearing cap, but yeah, moving on. He looks a bit intense, but maybe he's a good person. I'll describe my forte as well. Wait, uh, I thought you already mentioned your forte. Uh, you say nature's blessing, maybe something to control plants. I'm uncomfortable exposing classified information regarding investigators, but this is an emergency. Majima. Andrew Jen! He, he's the opposite of you! Yeah, I can guess that. <laughs> My forte is... Animal Investigation. Oh, there we go! <laughs> okay, so I guess it's right a little bit, but... <laughs> I thought he was controlling plants when he did nature's something, so it's like like something to do controlling plants, but okay, so he's controlling animals. Something to do with animals, okay. I guess it's a little bit right now. I can control animals as I wish. <laughs> yeah, and recruit them from my inquiries. Quite fitting for the philanthropist that I am. Me too. Though useful in many ways, I mainly use it to gather intel. It allows me to survey a target while remaining undetected. As a basic rule, I can only control four-legged mammals. Less intelligent animals are easier to control. I often use mice. They're the perfect animals for undercover investigations. Unfortunately, I can't show it off right now, because there aren't any mice on this train. Not only is he a good detective, but he also has those powers. He really is impressive. Yeah, I agree. That is all from me. With love, I yield to the next person. Oh, this is... Yeah, I see to it. Uh, didn't, didn't I it? just finish my introduction? Oh, no, no. I just just checking. I talked to this guy last because I'm a little bit afraid of this tongue guy, but... Uh, what about you? Hey, young man. Um, me? That's right. Come here. Stand before me. Uh, you're not gonna <laughs> do anything reckless, aren't you? Why? Man, you got one... <laughs> one minute good. Uh, uh, whoa. Huh? What's going on? Oh, Hagu! Measuring you. Huh? By hugging? Your forte is hugging? Uh, um... What are you doing? Uh, let's see. Uh... <laughs> Stay still for just a second. I'll be quick. Thank you. That was quite educational. That outfit fits you well. My name is Melanie Goldmine. My home is rather far north from here. Up there is a branch with detectives adept at spiritism. I was also active there as a medium. Oh, okay. Melamine Goldmine. A medium? I 
can summon the souls of the dead by using my body as a vessel. Summon a soul? Can you what? summon anyone who has died? Like, for example, the victim of a crime? <laughs> you mean you can do that just like my Maya Yes, of course. But there is one condition. I require the clothes that person wore while they were still alive. Uh, what? Only by wearing their clothes can I summon their soul. Wait, does it mean that you have to just undress the dead body and then, then try to, to you know, summon their souls or something like Hence that? Hence why my powers don't work on people smaller than me, or if the person is far bigger. Overall, the size must match. Okay, so that's the drawback. <laughs> I mean, this is actually a useful skill just in like Maya Fei, but this one is more like she has some sort of limitation that she needs the proper measurement size. If it's smaller or bigger, I don't think it will work. Unlike Maya Fei's one where she can just summon anytime she wants it. Also, I can't abide outfits with no fashion sense. Filthy, reeking clothes are always out of the question. And has that kind of personality taste, now my now. That sounds more like a preference than a condition. <laughs> you look like a death. <laughs> clothes make a man. They reveal all about one's livelihood. Like skin worn over skin. That's what clothes are all about. Consider that when compared to bare skin, Clothing has a greater surface area seen by other people. Therefore, clothes are an expression of a person's identity and originality. You ever think about how you've never heard of ghosts being naked? Huh? Ghosts wear clothing because those clothes are a part of their identity. Now that you mention it... That's why, despite your amnesia, I can tell the kind of person you are just by looking at the clothes you wear. Really? Your uniform is undoubtedly an official one supplied by the WDO. And I found it fits you perfectly after measuring your size. I don't think it could possibly belong to someone else. Which means... I really am I one or not? I can't figure it out without my memory coming back to me. That's all I have to say. I'm the medium detective Melanie. Nice to meet you all. Okay, so yeah, man, Mel Melamy's design is cool. cool I think. Wait, uh, wait. Oh yeah, I think I'm gonna save. You know, I always have to do this thing every single time I play this game, so I have to save frequently. Hey, oops, I. Yep, I can double save. <gasps> For the moment that I thought I didn't double say so never mind. Oh, a uh, profile. Do I get anything? Okay, so I got Melamy. Okay, we got a lot of those people. So okay, uh, how about you? An introduction. Introduce myself. A subjective observation of one's own self-image, explained objectively. Uh, are you okay? Did I do something that caused you concern? Uh, you're not a robot, aren't you? <laughs> uh, no, it's just you seem to be having difficulty introducing yourself. I rarely have a need to do so, so I was considering what approach to take. After all, is there such a thing as a self in the first place? Well, it's a type of cut. Okay, yes, no. All I am is a bundle of nervous tissue reacting to external stimuli. If I had to, I guess I'd call myself Poochie Lavman. You get... What? You get? <laughs> Did you even know your own name? Wait, Poochie Lav... Oh, Poochie Lavman. Uh, you're not an AI bot, are you? But, but okay. Could you laugh, Min? Yeah, at least smile good. Thank you very much. So your name is Poochie then? Names are meaningless. 
a method of arbitrary labeling for self-recognition, symbols for categorization, nothing more. To that end, it serves the same purpose as a detective deed, or so I, Poochie, believe. She seems a bit odd. Um, I'm gonna call her that she's a human eye. I'm gonna call her she's a human eye right now. <laughs> Most of the World Detective Organization's work is investigating unsolved mysteries. I was trusted with many bureaucratic investigations. My clients are mainly enterprises and politicians. Depending on the client, I use my forte to see if the transaction party is trustworthy. My forte is known as audio aptitude. Uh, I think it's something related to the sound. When oh. I concentrate, I can hear anything from distant whispers, footsteps, and even heartbeats. Oh, oh, so she's a human light detector. Or oh, some, something to hear sound from it. No one is safe to speak of their secrets when I, Poochie, am around. Oh, then did you hear anything suspicious at the station? Uh, maybe we can figure out what happened to me. Unfortunately, unless I focus my efforts on listening, I'm unable to hear things far away. Oh, I see. Oh, that sucks. Constantly listening in on all sounds leads to a sensation of my physical boundaries within reality dissolving away. My already tenuous sense of self starts to vanish, which is why I tend to close my ears unless I'm using my powers. Oh, so I'm guessing the headphones are the noise cancelers. Being blessed with powers sure comes at a price. Did she always act in such a strange way? Or did it develop after she obtained her forte? Hmm, I assume maybe it's after she gained her forte. Cause, you know, if she hears anything that she... The, you know, the, the fact that everybody... If they know her forte, people will start distrusting her cause... So they will just make, make false hope and then... Or try to, you know, lie their way out, but... She knows! Yet, that makes people distrust her more. Despite being honestly and and honest about it, if she he knows about it, this also works in a certain way. Which caused a lot of people to, you know, go to go far away, talk back back at other people. So yeah, that's a little bit hard to trust her. So I don't blame her blame how she been through now. Regardless, she definitely has a distinct air about her. That is all I have to say about myself. Oh. Oh! Oh, oh my! <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, wait! <laughs> is she blushing? <laughs> is she blushing right now? I take that back. Okay, I apologize. She's... She's cute! <laughs> This part of her seems a bit more normal. Yeah, you hold up blushing though. <laughs> oh yeah, I haven't talked to her. What the <laughs> Please to make your acquaintance, young man. Oh, okay. I hear a heart beating faster than usual. Is it my own? Yeah, I think that <laughs> Pucci loves it. <laughs> and like, uh, I think I can date. Uh, I think I can date. Maybe I can ask him after I reach to Kanagawa. <laughs> yeah, because both of them look at the same age and everything, so <laughs> her heart is beating up so far. So, okay, now, anyways. Okay, you really have to. I'm Mayfex Logan. I'm from the detective branch in the eastern slums. Apex Logan. They call me a master detective now, but I'm originally a broke illegal immigrant. When I was a kid, I was in an upstanding home living an upstanding life. My parents were lawyers who never tolerated injustice. They should have left well enough alone with that local mafioso. Ugh. Because they went after him, they were murdered. Their necks were cut open, right in front of me. That's awful. I ran away to protect myself, and 
and jumped on a ship at the port. I didn't know where the ship was going. That was the moment I threw away my past and my home. I drifted to the slums and did everything I could to I managed to survive until now, thanks to luck. With my natural talents, I was able to become a detective. But I also wanted revenge. I can't stand evil. But even if you ain't evil, I'll show no mercy to those who stand in my way. Uh, please don't kill me. If I can't figure out the difference between the good guys and the baddies, then I just beat up both of them. Kill or be killed is my motto. He looks scary, but that's not all. I think there's a deep sadness within him. Yeah, I don't blame him. With everything he's been true, so yeah. I can't share details about my forte. Just know it's kinda like radar. Okay. That's all you're going to tell us? You got a problem with that, you tiny runt? Whoa, 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 don't forget fight them, Mr. the top. Not at all. You sure are a frail looking kid, aren't you? And pale to boot. Like disaster's got its claws on ya. You sure nothing weird is haunting you? No way! <laughs> A detective's gotta be tough. How about a little training? You wanna box him? You wanna fight him now? No thanks! But first, you'll need to get used to stab wounds. We'll start with an ice pick, and scissors, and a fruit knife. Wait, what? Are you sure you're a detective or, or, or an executioner or a torturer? No thanks. Don't be shy. No, really, I'm fine. <laughs> this guy is more like a yeah, I'm talking to this guy right now. Uh, yeah, I think that's all I can talk to everybody, so... I wish I could take Lastly, a Lastly, it's your turn, you. Aside from having amnesia... I still can't remember anything. If you really are a master detective... <sighs> oh, young man, are you sure you don't remember? How about the kind of clothes you usually wear? Or brands you like? That's a... Yeah, that's all weapons you do. only inquired about clothing. Maybe you'll remember after a few punches to the head. Oh, come on. Please do not do that. Look, look. Yeah, this guy is a hug detective. So this guy is more like the bad cop of the good cop of the others. Hold on. Apex, stop that. If you knock him out, he won't be able to speak. Thank you. The perplexing circumstance we face may have something to do with his memories. That's right, I was wondering about that. What do you mean by perplexing circumstance? Did something happen? Well... Something unexpected has occurred on our trip. The number of people is off. The number of people? I, Hoochie heard from the World Detective Organization that the number of master detectives on the train was precisely five. Five? Wait, One, there's six people here. Two, three, four, five, six. There's six of us. I also heard from the WDO that five master detectives will gather on board. Hence why when you called yourself a master detective, I was honestly surprised. I knew this job wouldn't be easy, but there's already a mystery before us. <laughs> this is getting exciting. It's obvious what's going on. There's an imposter among us. Yeah, I'm talking you first, Apex. <laughs> Although, you might have a brutalish tough time of attitude, but I'm still talking you. It's not me. I... How about we contact the WDO and find out? It could be a mistake. Oh, okay, so on the on the table was the phone. It's no use. I can't reach them. There's no signal here. <laughs> Who could the uninvited sixth guest be? It's obvious. I'm the most suspicious. Especially with my amnesia in this situation. Yeah, I yeah, that's the thing, cause based on it, so yeah, you're probably the most sus of all. Could I be the imposter? And I just can't remember? I Alright, I got it. Hey, since you're all clueless, I'ma tell you my extra sharp deduction. You may speak. I'll allow it. Why would I need your permission? I mean, Zilt is already acting like a 
boss or the leader here while you trying to like trying to stab to stab you Ma, with all the weapons and even want to go fighting him punching him in the face so so yeah <laughs> I mean if the I mean if the old guy is not doing anything so I think we just make him make Zeus the leader whatever way I see it the runt here ain't the imposter wait wait I thought you were trying to suss him how come you now it's changed your mind huh It'd be boring if the most suspicious one is the culprit. The run must have been attacked by the real culprit. The memory loss is a side effect of the attack. And the imposter's motive? Why would they attack Yuma? To pretend to be a master detective and replace the runt on the train. The plan was going smoothly. The runt suddenly woke up. He got on the train right before it departed. And the results stand before us. Obviously, the imposter miscalculated. The Runt's gotta be tougher than he looks. Oh, that's a surprisingly proper deduction. Then I thought you'd be the most useless one here. <laughs> that's what I thought! <laughs> Why? In other words, I was knocked out at the station because someone attacked me? But I don't think I've been injured. Maybe you've been drugged, I think? Excuse me. My deduction is slightly different. Let's hear it. I'll allow it. Stop acting like we need to get your permission! I suspect that the entire situation is a test, designed by the World Detective Organization. A test? A WDO exam officer has disguised themselves as a member, and is ascertaining our skills here. If that were the case, Yuma here could possibly be the exam officer. Uh, I seriously doubt it because if if there's one person that can be an exam officer, it will be the old man. Sorry, the 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 snake, snake the the eye patch man over there. So no. Me, an exam officer? <laughs> Bring it on! I don't care if it's the WDO or a hitman. If you want to test me, I'll show you what I got. What are you trying to do? For now, I'll check to see if there are other uninvited guests. I wouldn't want any accomplices lurking about. And how are you going to do that? Like this! Uh, what? Let's go! Oh, so that's <gasps> what you mean by radar. Okay, so that's what I mean by radar. He means by by checking. Che what? What was that? A weird feeling overcame my whole body. No signs of the enemy. <laughs> Turns out there really are just six of us on this train right now. Um, what did you do? I used my forte, life detection. I can detect life in a 50 meter radius and pinpoint its location. The mechanism is a trade secret, but I can say without a doubt that we're the only ones on this train. Talk all you want, but who can verify that you're not lying? We're never gonna get anywhere if you start doubting everything! Use your own damn powers to figure it out then! Well, excuse me, I don't have a, a mice here. Did you even listen what I said to this kid? Forte's come in handy at a time like this. In that case, there's someone else with the power that can confirm if other passengers are on board. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah, Puch Puchi, huh? She can. Um, Puchi, would it be possible for you to verify what Apex said is true? Yes. I, Puchi, was contemplating it at the moment. In in return, could you go out date, date me? I mean, uh, hang out with me? Uh, what? What do you mean by that? Uh, not, no reason. So, so is it okay? Uh, sure, I guess. Even if someone is hiding, my audio aptitude is able to detect their breathing and heartbeats. Shall I try? Yes, please. Hey, what's with the gloomy little girl? Don't tell me she's motion sick. She's using her audio aptitude to check if there are other passengers. Oh, really? 
Well, that's great. Go for it. It'll prove I'm right. Shut. Huh? Oh boy. Shut up, you brain dead idiots! Pardon me. Would you mind quieting down for a bit? I need to concentrate. Oh yeah, because if you talk too much around her, she can't hear, so yeah. You break her concentration. I just noticed a, a bunny heckler. <sighs> Zeros belong in most of them are made of fur, and they always carry a bunch of oil. <laughs> what? This sensation. I felt it when Aphex used his powers. Somehow, it feels like I can hear what Poochie hears. hear it what's going on i think maybe if nobody knows it that means this is your forte i guess that you can you know other people's forte i guess now i finished i cannot hear the heartbeats of anyone besides the six of us here though one could hold their breath they still cannot stop their heart from beating in other words there's no one else on this train i hoochie guarantee it see I told you so! Sorry for calling you gloomy earlier, little girl. You know, I'm glad you've confirmed my findings, but... Aren't our powers kind of the same? I can hear heartbeats from 500 meters away. <laughs> yeah. So you're the useless one. <gasps> Quiet, you catty bitch! <laughs> Moving on... We've now got proof from two master detectives. We can say for sure that there are no other passengers. Though one may be a lying imposter, the other's statement can still be trusted. One of them, an imposter? But Aphex and Poochie both use their fortes. Yeah, but maybe you could say that some of them are lying because some people aren't using their forte just yet. I could feel them using their powers, so... I think it's safe to say both are master detectives. But I'm the only one who can sense their powers. No one else seems to have the same experience. Why am I the only one? <laughs> uh, you're gonna do s What's wrong with you, old man? You gone senile or something? Oh yeah, he, uh, we haven't seen these guys. Can you all hear that? Ah, oh, yes, the smell of dope. <laughs> the sounds of a running train, the wheels of fate chugging along. In the same way, our fate continues to turn. This train will press on until we reach our destination. No one can get off midway, including the uninvited sixth. Let's discover which of us is the caged bird in here. <laughs> My fading detective spirit Whoa, is revitalized what once again thanks to this burning mystery. Whoa, what the hell is this guy's face? This guy got way, seen way too much of, of a smile. Not bad. Things are getting interesting. You're joking. What could the imposter even accomplish? We're all master detectives here. And yet we don't know who the fake one is. I've used my power, so obviously I'm the real deal. The gloomy girl detective also passes. She ain't no fake. So, how about the guy blowing smoke, huh? Why don't you go ahead and prove yourself with your Again, we need animals, so I don't... I think it's hot, so... How about it, you four-eyed fox detective? Uh, it's a cat, but... Oh, wait, wait, wait. As I have already explained, my power involves animals. Without them, I can't use it. Okay, so I thought it's a cat, but fox it is. Now, 
So, you're fine being considered us. You are free to think what you wish. Unfortunately, I can't prove myself either. Without a dead body, I can't use my powers as a medium. Now we've got two suspects. How about you, old man? I don't mind showing off, but it won't clear any suspicions. The sixth uninvited guest could possibly be a traitorous master detective with their own forte. That's true. There's no end to this! To hell with it! Everybody line up! I'll deck you one by one! Dude, you're, you're already off suspicious and now you want to deck people? Really now? Whoever passes out is safe, got it? The real deal. If you don't pass out in one hit, then you gotta be the imposter! That's still a bullshitty logic right now. Calm down. Let's do things logically, like the detectives we are. Pardon me. I suggest we investigate this, starting with the motive for the imposter's infiltration. Hmm. The mo One possibility is that it's a test from the World Detective Organization. Are there any others? There are. You may speak. I'll a hundredth time. Why would they need your permission? Because you keep asking. Because you the one who keeps... Gives, gives uh, how to say... Oh, I don't know. Oh, keep saying, oh, let me deck all of you, so, and what, and whoever was whoever still standing is the imposter. The Amaterasu Corporation. They could be responsible for this. And your reasoning? Someone has been tailing me for the past few days. It started after I was first assigned to Kanai Ward. Wherever I went, I could sense the presence of someone in the shadows, but I could never catch them in the act. It was getting annoying, so I tried to bait them out. I walked around town in my underwear, and at last, they revealed themselves. Wait, wait what? Don't you mean bikini? Did you just say that you... Hmm? Something the matter? Oh, uh, you're not a stripper, aren't you? <laughs> <clears throat> Never mind. I avoid solving problems with violence, so I was unable to apprehend them. However... I saw them escaping in one of Amaterasu Corporation's cars with my own eyes. Why would Amaterasu Corp spy on you? Because they don't want Kanai Ward to be investigated. Perhaps this is the same situation. Which is why I think our uninvited sixth guest is a spy from Amaterasu. The spy has only one goal. To disrupt our trip to Kanai Ward. Hence why they are pretending to be a master detective among us. Hmm, so you believe Amaterasu is involved? Not impossible, though your reasoning is somewhat lacking. I do not see how escaping in one of Amaterasu Corporation's cars is proof someone is a company spy. Well, that's fair. Yeah, cause... It could be that logic, but then... Maybe, I think? Um, excuse... You keep talking about it, but what's... Are you kidding me? It's fine. We can teach you my. Okay, Amaterasu Corporation, Ama Amaterasu. Yeah, let's talk about that first. What is the Amaterasu Corporation? In short, Amaterasu is a freaking huge company. You see their products practically everywhere in daily life. They make everything from kids' toys to fighter jets. Industrial goods, electronics, pharmaceuticals, everything. Big companies always got dark underbellies. With Amaterasu, with their smoke, there's a whole building burning down. That's a detective joke. <laughs> okay. Sure, I got it. Thanks. Okay, so I have to ask everything just in case. We're heading to Kanai Ward. What does that have- It's fairly complicated. But Kanai Ward is essentially an Amaterasu Autonomous Zone. Previously, Kanai Ward was just another regional city. But as it was being developed by Amaterasu Corp, the city itself transformed. Factories, research labs, and affiliate companies were built. In no time, the whole place belonged to Amaterasu. As a matter of fact, Kanai Ward is essentially ruled by the Amaterasu Corporation. Political power has no influence there. Since it's so isolated, 
No one has been traveling to and from Kanai Ward. Isolated? Exactly. Because of that, no information has been getting out. Aside from rumors of unsolved cases, this has been going on for years. But the unified government has been turning a blind eye to the whole thing. The Amaterasu Corporation's influence affects not just the UG, but the entire world. Given the situation, the World Detective Organization couldn't wait any longer and decided to act. As a result, Master Detectives are gathering in Kanai War. And that's pure speculation, mind you. We won't know the full details until we arrive. I see. Thank you very much. Hey, and about Amata Tex, correct? Speaking of, this train is called... Yes. The Amaterasu Express is an entirely driverless train developed by the Amaterasu Corporate. The WDO made arrangements to prepare it for arrival at Kanai Ward. Normally, it has no passenger cars for the trip to Kanai Ward, but they added ours as a special exception. It features enough passenger space for all of us and a lavish dining car. Quite the warm welcome. A perfect setup to persuade us nothing is amiss in Kanai Ward. By the way, the windows and doors are completely locked until we arrive. They say it's for our safety. But I feel as though we're stuck in a big, moving coffin. All the sash windows are sealed, so they can't be opened. I, Poochie, confirmed it myself prior to the train's departure. Perhaps these measures were taken to prevent infiltrators or stowaways. Once it's en route, the Amaterasu Express becomes a box that's impossible to enter or exit. If you feel up to it, why don't you take a look around? But you can access the fifth car, the one at the end. The door appears to be broken and won't open. Broken? Well, go ahead and see for yourself. Right. Has anything you heard sound familiar? It feels like my first time hearing about any of it. Sorry. I see. It's alright. Just tell us if you do remember anything. Thank you. He seems nice and all, but maybe he's the imposter! Wait, what? <laughs> huh? Dungus Kane used to assist walking, but <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured that Dungus Kane is going to um, be a weapon. Did someone just speak? No. Hey, what's wrong? You've gone pale. How about you have something warm to drink and get some rest? Okay, here's some coffee. Do you drink it black? Or do you need some- Front probably wants milk. Hey, how old are you anyway? I can't tell from the way you dress. Never mind him. Here, have a drink to warm yourself up. <sighs> Thank you. What was that voice earlier? Am I- I have amnesia, and now I'm hearing things. What's happening to me? Yeah, don't worry about it. I wonder if it has something to do with the sixth person. Besides, who is this sixth uninvited guest? I should think about it a bit. Who is the most suspicious person here? Yeah, uh, I get to tell you that. As much as I want to point out it's Apex is is sus because he's acting like a tuck. Zilch is okay, Pucci is okay, Zange is okay, uh, Malami, uh, I would say it's you. Looking at things objectively, the situation I'm in is pretty strange. Not to mention the mystery of my missing memories. Regardless, I can't remember. Yeah. No matter how much I think about it, we have no proof of anything so far. Yeah, because if you think about it, we, all of everybody is at least at least playing their roles in detective ball. You being an MMZ, MMZ detective uh, might be a bit uh, sus already, because people might think you're lying on it. If I really am a master detective, 
I wonder if I can somehow remember what those powers were. Remembering now won't do any good. Oh, great. I'm here. again. I keep hearing that cheese. What's happening to me? Hey, Runt! Uh huh? Get over here. The old man is gonna show off his power. What? Uh, Zange? Okay. Photography, huh? I've heard someone has used photography to show the other side of the moon. Can you do that, Zange? Okay, let's see how this old man says it. Although I am reluctant to do so, I shall demonstrate my forte. You forced my hand. Otherwise, suspicions will continue to mount against me. What's that? Your cell phone? Quiet. Hey! Okay, time to use my. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, no. Okay, so. The heck? The heck do you do? The, uh, did you get all the viruses or something here in your phone? All the bug fragments? There it is again. I can feel Zonga using his forte. As I've said before, my power is photography. I can project my memories onto electronic mediums to generate and record footage. The recorded clip shows what occurred approximately five minutes ago. I suppose it's faster to simply show. the scene that took place about five minutes ago. I can only record about two to three seconds. Back in my prime, I was able to do ten. Also, as memories fade, the recorded footage will also fade. Oh. The rule of thumb is that it lasts around 48 hours, but by copying it to another device before it fades, footage can be used as evidence during investigations and in court. Ah, so the original will fade away, but if you copy it, it you still got that copy thing, so that's Pardon good. Pardon me, but are you sure this is photography? It appears as though you captured footage from a hidden camera. All you do is doubt everybody! Do you think being suspicious isn't constructive? Don't you believe that the truth lies beyond all suspicion? A detective's job is to suspect others. I'm hearing things again. Oh, great. I'm My memories haven't returned, and the voices keep getting louder. It's giving me a headache. It's like my own... Uh. Young man, are you all right? You don't seem well. I'm sorry. I feel a little... I believe you should rest. Maybe a nap will help get your memories back. The passenger rooms from car 3 and beyond are all full, so you should use car 1 at the f I believe there's an infirmary in there. It should be easy to monitor from where we're at in this- Monitor? You've- Will you be alright on your own? Sheesh, get a grip! Sorry. Huh? Did you say something? No, it's nothing. I'm alright. I can get there by my- Uh... Uh, can you come with me? Uh, no, uh, can we bring her along? Uh, hi, uh, can you come with me, please? Um, hey, look, hey, do you need any assistance? So, no, sorry. I'm fine. I can go on my own. If you say so. Damn, I missed my chance. What? <laughs> nothing, nothing. I'm not talking to this guy. This guy is probably going to punch my face if I can't. Uh, uh. Man, I feel like this is more like the rest. Oh, oh, what's this? A map? It's a map of the. Tr uh. Oh man. Man, I'm walking so slow. Yeah, but I can't go in there because it's locked. Wait. It's locked. You gotta find the key first. The Where is the key? I see, I see. If the entire 
area of the mini map is shining. They missed the destination. They missed the destination. Oh, investing. Even time map. Oh. Uh. Yeah, I guess. It opened. I think I need. Well, I see myself. I think I need. Yeah, I just hope there's no zombie. Okay, no zombie. That's good. Um, hi. And he got. Ouch. It's time to get up. Oh uh, no, it's just ten more minutes. Get up, 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 or I'll boom kill you. Wait, what? <laughs> boom, what? <laughs> like you're going, boom, 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 kill. Wait, wait, what did you say? Huh? Boom. <laughs> 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 So you can finally see cute little me. <laughs> it's all taking root. Hello, <laughs> Joe. What? Huh? What is this thing? How can you call me a thing when I'm so adorable? Well, aren't you rude? It's talking! Not only am I hearing things, I'm seeing things too? Malami, what drug did you put inside? What copy do you make? I've completely lost it! Snap out of it! You are my master, aren't you? What? Master? That's right. We exchanged an intimate secret pact just between us. Huh? What pact? What? You've forgotten all about how we were so passionately bound together? Huh? Oh, how cold of you! After I offered myself to you and you alone! You're so irresponsible. Take ownership of your actions. I don't, I don't do. know. You forgot that's part of the contract. You don't get a death god for free, you know. If you want to eat, you gotta bring something to the table. Wait, what did you just say? A death god? Call me Shinigami. 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 Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Death god sounds so ominous and creepy. Ain't my style, you know. I'm too cute for that. I was born <laughs> okay. too pure and innocent. Oh, you get me? I'm too cute. <laughs> that's why I prefer to go by Shinigami. Anyway, that's oh, that god in Japanese. Don't wear it out. <laughs> much. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good answer, Master. You keep calling me Master. Wait, are you haunting me? Please call me Shinigami. Shinigami. Yup, yup. Of course, I'm 100% haunting you. I'm haunting you like your life depends on it. What? That was your wish after all. That was the end of a stalker. Contract. Oh, contract. Okay. Oh, wait, what contract did it? That's what I wanted? That's you need to go And for our sweet, sweet contract, you offered something in return. That is? Offered? <gasps> you finally got it? Offered your own memories. <laughs> Wait, this boss is more like that rocket chick from Danganronpa 2. Pointy! Oh, yeah, Ibuki, Ibuki, yeah. You tossed away your entire past and smashed our fates together. Uh, That's why I have amnesia? Your 
euphoria from completing our contract made you pass out in that room. Even though you woke up, it took some time for me to take root in you. But I can talk to you now, which makes me happy. Not. What? Why? Which is it? Why would I make a contract with you? Why did I offer my memories? Sorry, but I can't share the contract's details with you. Those are the rules. Oh. Why not? Tell me! No can do it. That's the contract. You okay, so I'm guessing if you break it, you might die, I think? By the way, Master, something's been bothering me. What is it? Two hours have gone by since you passed out. Two hours? Huh? Two hours? Yep. And here I was, waiting for you to wake up. Admirable, right? Malami, what drink do you give, give it to him? Do you put in some sort of sleeping drug or something? During that time, no one came to check on you. They're all so cruel, you know? Maybe they forgot about you. Speaking of, why am I here? Well, Is you come inside this the to restroom try it. In the first car? That's right. I felt sick at the dining car, so I was looking for the key. You sh when you feel sick, I get irritated. Your haunting presence is probably why I felt sick in the first place. <laughs> oh, you hey, don't blame me. Anyway, you better hurry and take a look around. That's right. Where are the others? I think maybe they are in the other room side, so yeah. Uh, I need to check my mirror. Are you sure that no one is... Hmm? Why are you staring in the mirror? Are you the type of guy with a mess himself until he dies of heartbreak? <sighs> I can't see in the mirror. I need to hear this voice. It's not hallucinating. <laughs> you still didn't believe me? This place? There's nothing looks familiar. Well? You have no memories, Master, so of course it's not in the familiar. I guess you're right. I think I need to take a door. Uh, it's the door to the private room. It's not locked and there's no seem to anyone inside. You good? You should want to open and check. Maybe a homicide maniac is hiding inside there. <sighs> like me, I'm hiding inside there. God damn. That's no way. And can you come out there? Oh, okay, okay. Jeez. What's going on? Wait, what? Fire? It's me! Oh, Miss Dearful! Miss Dearful? What? Weren't you watching over me the whole time? I can't be separated from you. That should be obvious since I'm haunting you. Okay, so oh, it's more like chained together. dumb sleeping face in the restroom. I have no clue what happened outside. So what happened here? Hey, look, look! There's smoke coming in through the cracks of the door! Right! Is there a fire? Fire? So it's burning? In a tree? Now I'm getting excited! Excited? We have to do something! Wait, we need to check. Oh. I can't do it. What are we? God damn it, I cannot go that way. Okay, let's check this. Going on. <gasps> Zilch! Oh no! Silch, please wake up! Silch! Hey Fox boy, get up! There's too much smoke! I, I gotta help! Master! Look! <gasps> <gasps> Alright. Burn? He's burned to death already? No, I'm an ambush. Why? Why did this happen? 
there's no time to rest. If you're a detective, you know what to do. Huh? Search the body. You need to confirm if someone is really dead by checking... Me? Maybe I should ask for help. Why would a detective run from a corpse? I don't know that I'm a detective. Well, you sure are one. Otherwise, you wouldn't have asked for help from yours truly. Huh? What's that supposed? I'll explain it another time. But since you've forgotten, I'll be your mentor and train you to be a proper detective. Yay, thumbs up. So get to it. I'm really. De of course, the mystery is practically solved when a detective is first on the scene. <sighs> Investigation. Oh boy. It's completely chopped. No movement. No breathing either. I can't feel a pulse. The smell of burnt flesh is too much. A knife is still lodged in the chest. This is the only knife wound. I don't see any other injuries. Well, Ooh. how's our corpse doing? He's dead. What do you want me to say? Dead, without a doubt. Both to death. Thought so. Kind of charred, after all. <sighs> Don't be so glum. You had to check the corpse in any. It's not that. I mean, if I'd noticed sooner. You think you could have saved a life? Forget about it. If you're so worried, try CPR. Though you'll be tasting soot doing that to such a charred corpse. <laughs> Anyone with common sense won't do CPR on the corpse. Come on. What's dead is dead. Never let that get you down. Right. I have to tell the others about this. Yeah, but can we still check the corpses on? <laughs> this how could it Yeah, happen? yeah. You know what to extract. No, I think that you do. You don't seem to be enthusiastic. Okay, better hurry. Yeah, we should see. Uh, is there anything? Fire extinguisher. This is... The fire extinguisher I used on the floor. Looks like it's mostly empty. Master! You open the lock and pull out the fire. That was some quick thinking, Master. And now you can check out the cops' clothes in person. <laughs> AED. <laughs> this the AED from the employee. Using this on this will probably won't help. Well... You want to use that on a human charcoal? If he did come back to life, he won't be happy about it. Uh, this? This is... This is medical equipment coming for me. I don't know how to use it. But... Even if you don't know how to use it, there's no saving someone in the space key. You can ask Charles guys to chuck the bag before you get it there. There's a pillow. Uh, I can't check down there too. Uh, is there anything I can check over here for some... No, the toilet, I think it's really done. Uh, anything here? Uh, is this my... Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I can't check here, so... Uh, anyone? Hello? Huh? Um... What the f... Malami's dead? <laughs> Way. Is this a dream? This has to be a dream, right? Maybe it's a nightmare! <laughs> you look so enthusiastic, Jinagami! Please, I wanna wake up! I can't take this anymore! You're so pitiful, you know that? Are you sure you're the guy who sold your soul to me? What are you anyway? Friend or foe? You're oh? a friend, of course. After all, you're my master. Isn't that nice? I'm your friend, and I'll be haunting you till death do us part. I don't get it! Why would I make a contract with the Death God? Wait, do they even really exist? Maybe this floating thing is just a figment of my imagination. Shut up, you're trapped! You memoryless, courageless, brainless detective! This is a nightmare to you, then you gotta use all you got! But... What can I even- That's why I'll be your teacher and mentor. I'll make you a proper detective yet. Just listen to me and everything will be A-OK. -okay. First, check the stand-up. Come on! 
Oh god. Okay, so I'm gonna see that the part of the title massacre is not not a, not a joke. Oh god, I'm not having a This feels very, very well done. Liquor bottle. There are empty liquor bottles around. All of them apparently have high alcohol on the tape. Will Malami have been set on fire with this? Yeah. Oh, it's the best way to cook the stench of meat. Yeah. What a rich fragrance! How about a taste, Master? What? What taste? Uh, why are you eating? Shinigami, what the hell are you eating? Oh, let me drink my tea. Yep, 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 yep. Smell of me, all right. She's completely burnt to a crisp. But I recognize what parts are left of her. There's no pulse or breath. No doubt she's been dead for a while. And there's a bottle of liquor nearby. You found two corpses back to back? <laughs> Dog of there's nothing Beginner's left luck? Are you crazy? So, what's the cause of death? Huh? Oh, um. So she. Such a... Yeah, she got burned to death. Oh, sorry. So I'm just yeah. This is not lucky. This is more like the title Conan, Conan style where, or Kendaichi's style where every single detective. I'm gonna quote quote what what Inspector Maguire would say. Everywhere you go, a dead body always shows. Everywhere you go, the kid go, the pop shows up. Come on, man. Have you ever noticed that? <laughs> uh, bar counter. This is. That's where the bottle liquor is, she... Yeah, that's right! She was flambe on the pricey, pricey looking liquor, huh? Now, where'd go? Uh... Let's go to the next one! Okay, so that's the one's here, so... Huh? What the heck? Did it just shake? Uh, blackout? What the hell? What was that? The lights went out for a moment and came back on. Oh, it got dark outside. Looks like we're in a tunnel. Anyway, shouldn't you be hurrying? You should probably tell the other master detectives, yeah? Right, that's right. Oh boy. Gucci's coat, a treasure's a small panel appropriately adored the shoulder of Gucci's coat. What? Okay, third car. Hey! Is anyone there? We need help in the first two cars! Zonge! Gucci! Apex! Anybody! <sighs> hmm, no response. I smell a tragedy. This is like the very picture of hell. Woohoo! One mystery after another! I can't hold back from all this excitement. We have to find the others right away! Oh boy. I'm getting excited here! Okay, this is number three, so. Come on! I'm a detective wind. What do you think you're gonna do in my car, too? There's no one else alive there. You're supposed to go to check on our tree. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Uh, let's see. Okay, three is one. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, gee. Oh, no way. Oh, come on! Number three. <laughs> If you don't want to end up like this, then you better be more prudent. How do we say prudent? The train hasn't gotten to the destination yet, and you can't get off halfway. Which oh, means whoever God. killed these guys is still in the train, right? I swear to God that. But who that... would do such a thing? You'll find out if you investigate. You better nail it, Master. Regardless, you should leave the door open to be safe. Gotta make sure you don't get cornered. Yeah, that's a good thing. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. Oh shit. And she and she wants to go dating with him. Like, uh, god damn it. Come on, of... It's Poochie's corpse. I can barely make out what's left of her face. She doesn't appear to have any external wounds. There's a blanket over her torso. Looks like she was burned when the blanket was set on fire. 
Uh, I'm gonna really gonna kill the guy. Yep, it's a corpse. <laughs> yeah, no shit. She didn't got me. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, let's see what. What the heck? It's up there. This is. This big teddy bear might be a uh, person of long legs. <laughs> you better be careful, master. It might suddenly start going. <laughs> <laughs> That's not even Monokuma! <laughs> it's, it's still making reference to Nagaropa. <sighs> it's just a teddy bear. It's like, as if something strange could happen. Tango. Surely. Let's see. Is this Poochie's bag? Maybe there's a weapon for self defense inside. It'd be good for you to check it out. I'm sorry, Poochie. I'm taking a look inside. There's a change of clothes and travel supplies. No weapons or other self-defense item. It's a wash, then. It was sitting there like a treasure chest, so... I was hoping there'd be a rare metal inside. <laughs> Why are you thinking? This is not like... RPG. I Why was is this happen? Master, let's move on if you're done here. There's no time to waste. But he, but he wanted... I know we have feelings for each other. Come on, did you? Oh, Poochie, why? Right. Where's Zonge? And if? Uh, I think uh, I'm gonna blame the. This is. There's a set of cat he head earphones. Poochie must have been a lava. Hmm. She never took the headphones, even found people, right? How rude. Let's not speak ill of it. I sure she had a reason. Uh, everyone's dead. Uh, if I swear to God, if it the old man or the first last all all apex hmm. kill them, I'm gonna really be pissed off right now. Uh, who's this one? Whose bag is this? Oh, it's open. You're a detective. Why even ask? Detectives search people's bags and cupboards all the time. Smashing pots to find what they want is part of the job. <laughs> this is not Zelda! <laughs> That's too much! This is not linked to the pots! <laughs> Notice. World Detective Organization, Human Reese, Dear Zilch Alexander. You are oh, here so this for this duration. Use the enclosed ticket to board the... Upon arrival, proceed to the nocturnal... De there, you will receive further... Go forth, proud detective. Yeah, this is... This is a letter for Zilch. The only things inside are work documents. Ah, that's no fault. Okay, so this is Zilch's one. Okay, kill blush and and then this is this is Zilch's brush. There's something, some blood stuck in the bristle. Then PP was a clean frame. No matter how now he's, he's with the pips. Zilch. Uh, animal pot glasses. Animal print glasses case. This is. It's a glass case with animal print. Like there's nothing inside. This probably belongs to Zilch. Right. He was the only one wearing glasses after all. Uh, I don't suppose I can run. Okay, now I can hold on. Uh, backup control. This isn't a passenger room. The sign says backup control room. Wow, it looks like a secret base. Don't you want to destroy these whenever you see them? No. If you do that, we're probably gonna crash. There's no. no one here, so I should go look for it. How about you check out that machine over there? It's okay, I won't break it. Fine. You can't break it. Even... This thing and it'll be good as new. Wait, what? Hmm. This thing looks like some kind of control device. It might be dangerous, so I shouldn't touch right. it. Yeah, you wouldn't want to press the wrong button and cause a chain to derail. What, what the heck? Okay. Oh. Okay, I can move the mouse here. Route map. This is the train map. The shining part must be the train's current location. After we exit this long tunnel we just entered, we'll. It's been a long trip. But I'm sure it's been a shorter one for us. Um. Oh boy, we're going to reach Kanai World and he's going machine? to be a prompt south snag if you keep all the dead bodies there. Backup control system? The control system automatic manages the electric within the train. When the main control system fails, it switches to the backup system after one second. So the control system manages the electricity. 
this one is the backup, not the main one. Hey, what about the file over here? What is... It looks like an explanation about uh, the control system will supply electricity as programmed and drive the train. But all train cars on the train have motors that run up. Because of that, it can easily climb steep... Hmm. I guess everything here relies on that control... So, if you destroy the main and backup control systems, you can stop the train. Yes, but then it would derail the train, so no tanks now. Right now the control system is functioning, so the train is still moving with no issue. The monitor displays an operation log, but there's no record that the train has stopped. Yeah. Master, while you were sleeping like a log, I never sensed the train stopping either. The doors won't open unless it stops and the windows are all locked. No one can get on or off while it's... Huh? What's wrong, Master? I noticed the backup control system is operating. Well, it's better that it's running. All the electricity is managed by the control system, after all. Anyway, Master, I'm for- Move on. Yeah, I think there's nothing much to do, so... Yes, she's right. But yeah... Oh, wait. Intercom. Oh, there's an intercom. Press the button during emergency and pick to... In emergency, press the button and speak to the receiver. Oh. Yeah! And now we're... won't connect. If it doesn't... If this system was completely automated... Maybe... Everyone in Control Headquarters is already dead. And you're the last living human in the world. What a horrible thing to say. Yeah, this is not a zombie apocalypse. Come on. Ugh, boy. In the end, there weren't any survivors in this train car. Yeah, you're right. Let's go to the next one! Oh, book would she... Ugh... And she must get the data book. Okay, fourth one. Zangiski. Okay, this one. Okay. Who's um, it? is anyone there? <sighs> Watch oh. out! Oh boy, it could be another dead body. There are other places. It could be. Yeah, but um. Okay, let's see who's this one. Okay, no one's here. There's nothing here. If each person gets their own room, then... It can't be... Yeah, it's nothing. What? Hush! <laughs> you... Tissues! Is... There are a lot of tissues on there, but maybe... He can't turn down the free sample when it people hit <laughs> Oh yeah, so, so many reasons why someone's going to keep tissue next to me. <laughs> what are you implying, Shinigami? Okay, uh, uh... Who does have the jacket? He looks like something Ape- Oh, Ape! Say. Did you check the pockets? There's nothing inside there. <laughs> well, if you don't know the blanks, it doesn't make a very cute. Magazines? Hmm? There's a magazine scattered on the desk. There's a protesting magazine. Where are the hot anger these days? Yep. I don't think there's anything to do here. Let's check somewhere else. Okay, next one. Let's. I'm dead, dude. Oh, oh God! Hey, Max! I swear to God, if you're the one who killed everybody, I'm gonna really want to strangle you right now. Because you're a death god. No. I think it's awesome. My heart's. Joy. What's with the change on Oh boy, what's wrong with this? This is all wrong. You think? Oh. Wait, She's dead. Come on. Sange. He's burnt to a crisp. I can just barely discern his face, though. I can't find any particular external wounds. He was also incinerated in a burning blanket. All three of them were sleeping in bed and... Oh, what's this? Zange's cell phone. Maybe his thought no good. Just a video of me drinking coffee. It can't help me solve this mess. Oh, uh, a prax I'm going to That's four of them. 
There are just six people on the train. Zilch, Melanie, Pooch, Hip, hey, Apex. Hey, Took you long enough. I, you still need work, Master. So Apex is the culprit? He murdered the others in such a deranged way? Yeah. This guy short fuse sounds pretty. It was a crime of passion. No, he's a master detective for sure. I... You sensed it? Hmm. You sense it, but maybe... But maybe like the other guys who says that he's, he might be using his... A uh, spice or somebody might have have their forte, so that's if he betrayed the WD up, it's reasonable to conclude he Anyway, time to you are totally about to say that. Right, Matt? Not at all. What Boomkill? I'm not being Boomkill. I'm actually surprised you haven't died yet. I won't deny it. I was supposed to be in the infirmary in the first car. Maybe that's why the kill <sighs> Oh, I just remembered Huh? What's up? Master, I told you that while you were passed out, but one time, the door did open. I, by the time I noticed, the door closed again. Now that I think about it, could it have been that guy with the... So, he let me go? Hmm, maybe he thought you weren't even worth killing. Karen and Cup, that wasn't a diss, just a fact. I know. Now that we know who the culprit is, we have to find... Find him and do what? Catch him, of course, and it's all... That's impossible! It's fine. There's nothing fine about it. Oh god, he's dead. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, let's see if anything okay. This looks like Sangi's bag. There's nothing inside that This is this might be long Zangi, they look well used so they could be really old. Say. What do you look inside it up and there might be something in the case? It seems to be recorded of a spasky hand though. But it's not information for a case. Okay, so I'm guessing this must be Melami's room, she's the only one left. Yep. Check, check. Yeah, this is Melami's room. It's a woman's travel bag. Melami gold mine. Looks like makeup and travel supplies. Hey, did you check to see if someone's hiding nearby? Yeah, no one's here. You sure? What if he's hiding in the back? That's m <laughs> that's small. Nah. Even a child couldn't hide him. In... You don't know that. You're up. What if there's a master detective who has the appearance of a child, but the mind of an adult? Of course there isn't. You sure about that? I think there's totally a detective like that out there. Uh, moving on. This is... There are women's book clothes on the bed. I wonder if they belong to Melani. Yeah, that's right! This is our flesh trend. She's definitely got some lupus in the city. But now she's all burned. Guess she won't be wearing this anymore. <laughs> Melani, why did she have to die? This is... Yeah, the part of the cosmetic on the bed. That's why it belongs to Melani. But she never used it again. Well? Yeah, she applied make... You shouldn't apply makeup to the freshmen after all. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, on to the next car. Okay, uh, I assume we are all of the... Okay, so we are on the tunnel. It got brighter. Guess we made it through the tunnel. Which means we're almost there. At this rate, you'll let the murderer escape. Yeah, and you'll get framed for it. Uh, what the heck? More shaking? What is it this time? Master, you gotta hurry! The next train car is the fifth one. This train... Oh, but... But you can't access the fifth car. The one at the end. The door appears to be broken. The door was supposed to be broken. Master, you better hurry! Yeah, let's... Wait. Hey, it opened. Was it repaired? What? How? Uh... Whoa, it got blown off! It's been wrecked. What happened here? Master, look over there! What now? Apex, I swear to God... Oh. Shit! Dead body. 
Now mine, he's dead no too. It can't be a, a fifth corpse. Because that would mean everybody except me is dead. So mysterious. Even I'm getting confused now. Oh boy. Anyway, this is time to investigate. Huh. Wait, I need to check if there's anything else. Are you pretending? No, no, no. I need to check. Okay, no. This isn't a fake. It is, without a single doubt, the bona fide remains of a human. I'm positive about that. I specialize in corpses, after all. I'll check for signs of light. No, I think he's dead. Uh, no. Apex. He's completely dead, huh? His necklace looks from wait. It's the same one Aphex was looking at the body type of the corpse. It matches the guy with the short fuse. His face is burns beyond recognition. You might find it unbelievable, but it seems like it. Yeah, I don't see any up. Yeah, but wait. There's an injury on his chest. Wait, there's a blade right? dagger. I'm surprised you know. Is it a stab wound? That's the case. Was he stabbed to death? No, he could have been incapacitated by the stabbing. It's impossible to determine the cause of death with what we have. Oh, you've gone full throttle in this invest to me for being your mentor. But why, Ape? Yeah, but. Mm. Yep, this corpse is real too. Anything inside here? It says main control room. It's no use. It won't open. There's a driver's seat in there, but I don't- Hey, Master, maybe someone's hiding in there. I don't think so. The door looks- Aphex and Pucci both said that there were only six, so including me. Hmm, I oh, why are there two control- They probably have control rooms so it can go in either direction. This is the last car for where we're heading. Oh, well, now that you mentioned- Oh boy, this is- okay. It won't open, but this is- yeah, I don't. Oh. Okay. Huh? What's this? What is it? Did you find some? The interior lock is open right now, but look, there appears to be blood on it. Hmm. Oh, you're right. Let me try to slide it. Oh yeah, there's blood. It's a blood stain, all right. It seems the blood got on there while the door was locked. That's evidence of something for sure. No harm keeping it in mind. Yeah. Sure hope you got all that down. This is... Yeah, medical deep. Hey! Wait. Huh? Why does the... F Wait, how come huh? the fire string is here? Hmm? So I'm just gonna try to pull it out. Hmm. Hold on, something's odd, something's odd. Really? Really? Burn bread. This is... There's a bird in the clip hmm? side. Why else something? Hmm. Hold on. Uh, something's... Why does the fire saint church do that? It seems like the first car. Okay, I'm just a little saw some something. Restroom. The restroom is in terrible shape. There's no one inside. Yeah, it's burnt to crib, so... Anyone inside? No. I don't see anything. Hmm. Huh? That's weird. This area seems more burnt somehow. Maybe there was something flammable in there. See? Look there! There are traces of something that got burnt. Is that some sort of plate to split? But why is this the only one completely... Uh, I'm a... Really? Yeah, I'm having a list. Hello? It says main control. It's no use. You won't. There's a driver's seat in there. Oh shit, we. Thank you for choosing the Amaterasu Express Direct to Kanai Ward. We are approaching Kanai Ward. Master, we are almost at the station! You have to catch. Catch who? Everyone besides me is dead! Yeah, that's the thing. Sure it's everyone? Calm down. Silch in car Melami in car two. Pucci in car three. Zanga in car four. And Aphex in car five. Yeah, everyone's dead. See? That's five. That makes you the only possible killer master. 
Did he do it? <laughs> no, I'm already drunk. How the hell? Are... It, no, that's not possible. But I can't say for certain. There's something wrong with me. Death gods are said to reap human souls. Maybe subconsciously. We are approaching Kanai World. Yeah, um, we were finished. Oh boy, we're gonna get screwed in this thing. Uh, are you... Uh, can I save this, Alan? Police already there? Wait, the police is already there? What the hell? Master, those guys from before are still on the platform. Why is this happening to me? Oh boy. Ah, they're coming in. We gotta go. Uh. I wonder if Master can even make snap judgments. Master? Doesn't make mistakes, right? Ninja, right? what? What? This is cut time. Right? No, no, no! I'm going out. I'm going out. Ninja dot. Okay, so quick timey QTE QTE. Who are these people? The police. They're not your friends. That much is for sure. Yeah, but they're coming way too soon. Like, did, did somebody report them? Considering the state of the crime scene, they're totally gonna pin it on you. Yeah, tank. <laughs> but. Oh boy. Oh. Yeah, these guys are the police, I think. Uh Oops, sorry, I thought it's a fire. Uh, uh, bye bye. We have news around it. Got you. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I got him! I'm gonna- oh. Okay, at least the QTE is a bit slow. Come here! Seriously, why the police are there? How do they know that? <laughs> Wait, this Amaterasu police was hot. Yeah, when I see them, it's like, oh great, the pol Wait, the police are there already? Oh great. Uh, do we need the QTE to beat this guy? Oh, no, no, no. Uh, uh, looks like you're done for. Uh, shit. Wait, please listen to me. I can explain. Yeah. <laughs> What's that to talk about? You're a master detective of the WDO, aren't you? Oh, uh, who the hell is this guy? The name's Swank Katsunel. I'm with the Amaterasu Corporation's peacekeepers. Swank Castone. But with the money, two. Uh, hi. Okay. Oh boy, I think I'm being set up for fuck's sake. Amaterasu Corporation peacekeepers? Yeah. Okay, it's not police force. Peace. Okay, it's peacekeepers. Okay, it's not police force. Don't act like you don't know. You're a WDO detective for crying out loud, or. Are you some sort of imposter? No, I'm not. I think. I got amnesia, you come on! Think? Well, I don't care either way. What's about to happen has already been decided. Which is? Uh... The peacekeepers are the defenders of law and executioners in Kanai Ward. You 
the unjust wander into my space, they will be eliminated. Okay, now he's moved into a, a sign of sim. Eliminated? You seriously feeling me, right? Hey, isn't Kanai Ward under the complete control of Amaterasu? Yes. Meaning these people are like the police here. Yeah, I'm guessing corrupt is. Is is law here? Cause I think when it comes to corrupt police, yeah, they are the laws here. Ugh. Police? But it's just some company security department. Yes. Look at the, look at the attire. This this is a, just like like those military people. <laughs> hey, who are you talking to? Nothing. Oh, right. You're the only one who can see me. Thanks to our contract, master. It's a bit cliche at this point, huh? <laughs> Don't laugh! Help me! I'll ask again! Who do you think you're talking to, huh? Talk about suspicious! Uh, nothing? I just... I'm sorry! Tell me how you're gonna explain this sit we prepared that trip. Welcome you all here. But an internal fight sprawling into a bloodbath was unexpected. A bloodbath? It's not what it looks like! There's a perfectly logical explanation behind this. Uh, I don't think you can say this all of me. Well, that was direct. Master, try your best to beat him. How? <laughs> no, I really don't know any. I don't think so. While the other detectives proof, there's the copy and Oh, uh, what, 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 what? What's going on? What the... We found coffee and wine in the dining car. When we checked the second car earlier, I had a subordinate drink it. You can see what it looks like some sort of knockout drug was mixed into a drug? Which means you drugged the other detectives and killed them while they were passed out. Wow. He may just be a lowly grunt, but he knows his stuff. He could be trouble. They're not helping, Shinigami. Why do you sound so impressed? So did you figure out the cause of death? Yes, they all burned to death. Huh? All of them? How cruel of you to kill them like that. What's your end game in this? Is it money? Or is it money? What that gotta do? If it's money, then hand over everything you swiped. I promise I'll show mercy to your wallet. What about me then? He just wants money. That's no fair. I'm not the culprit. Yes, you are! You're the culprit! No! I'm not the perpetrator. But do I know that for sure? In this situation, who else besides me could have done it? Yeah, I was almost thought it was Apex, but now I'm thinking thinking it was hit. Yeah, but it can't be. There were without a doubt only six people on the train. And five of them were so the only possibility. Just admit it! I. What am I supposed to do? Admit it now! You're guilty! Am I? Come no, on, you're not. Confess! <laughs> man, this guy is trying to. Man, this guy is trying to. Trying too hard. Something is not right here. Maybe it's better if I. No, could, don't! It could be better to get through this now and get some time to think about it. No, no, no. If you do that thing, they will just arrest you or probably put you into death sentences. I mean, it's five people. Come on. Why confess if you didn't do it? Master, you're an idiot. Don't boot kill you. Huh? You heard me? There you go again, talking to you. I hear your thoughts, too. I told you we share the same mind and body. Anyway, never mind that. Why are you giving up? Well, there's nothing I can do. Wrong. The mystery solving has just begun. Why did you make a contract with me to begin with? Huh? Then how are we supposed oh, to deal with this situation, Shinigami? Mean. Shut up! Stop talking to yourself, you unstable psycho! Hey! Bring him down, men! Confiscate anything of value he has while you're at it. <laughs> oh boy. Uh -oh. Stop with all that pitiful moaning! I'll show you exactly what I'm made of right now! Come on, Master! Where are we going?
Is that you, Junko? Huh? Wait, no, Junko doesn't what, look like that. What is this? What's happening? Uh, so I'm guessing she died and become she got my uh, Shinigami. The time stop. What's this? What's going on? Who are you? What do you mean? I you the entire time. Wait, you're Shinigami? Oh, right. Guess you can't tell because I'm not puffy anymore. I can only access the mystery labyrinth if I'm at full power, so I had to change forms. <laughs> Do what? Huh? Some parts of me are mm. still nice and puffy. It's true. Want to touch? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> uh, okay. No, no. Anyway, what's going on? It's like time has stopped. And what's that hole? That hole is connected to the mystery labyrinth. The mystery labyrinth? You'll find out when you enter. Come on, let's go! Wait, I don't know where to go! To tell me, what's a mystery labyrinth? Save the deeds for later, Kek! What? Ooh! <laughs> Why? Yeah, she said she and Gami had the same vibes of June. Those craziness, only she's into solving mysteries and reading souls. Ow!